at every stage of your keyword research, you need to be realistic. Not all keywords will be able to get you through to Google's top 10. So you need to ignore those that are too ambitious. You can determine if a certain keyword is really worth your time and effort by looking at the keyword difficulty metric, which has already been touched upon several times throughout the course. Now, we'll learn how to pick realistic keywords for our SEO campaign with the help of the Keyword Difficulty tool. It enables you to analyze up to 100 keywords at a time, and you can decide which keywords will be the most beneficial to your SEO. And you can also find SERP feature opportunities. Let's explore the tool. Prepare a list of up to 100 keywords you want to analyze. Paste it in the tools box, then click the Show Difficulty button. The table with your keywords will show up with the following metrics for these keywords. Volume, number of results, a list of SERP features triggered by the keyword, and of course, keyword difficulty. Let me remind you what keyword difficulty is. This metric is an estimation of how hard it is to outrank your competitors when targeting for a certain organic keyword. The higher the keyword difficulty is, the more effort it will take to get higher rankings. How is the keyword difficulty calculated? We analyze the domains that occupy the Google's top 20 organic positions that give it a keyword. Based on each domain's SEMrush rank, we calculate its domain strength and then its keyword difficulty. Overall, there are three keyword difficulty levels. High difficulty with a score above 80. High difficulty keywords are very hard to rank for, especially if you're working with a new website. Medium difficulty with a score from 60 to 80. Yet medium difficulty keywords are hard to rank for it's still possible to end up atop of the Google's rankings when targeting for them. Low difficulty with a score below 60. Low difficulty keywords are the easiest to rank for, but it's quite a challenge to find among them the ones that bring reasonable amount of traffic. So, getting back to the table, you can sort it by keyword difficulty in ascending order to see keywords with the lowest difficulty first. This table section allows you to see if any of the keywords entered show up in SERP features. Winning a SERP feature means getting more organic traffic, so you might want to consider this opportunity. The Keyword Difficulty tool helps you figure out which keywords are worth targeting for. Focusing on terms with moderate difficulty could be right to your SEO strategy because they'll give you higher visibility with the same amount of time and effort spent. Remember, take a look at related posts on the SEMrush blog and visit our knowledge base and go through reports by yourself.